just a week ago, we had trees down, limbs down, specifically along the coastline, and now we're getting this stuff happening inland. This is, this is another destructive storm. It is, Todd, and we talked about, you know, how much last week's storm play in. I mean, I certainly think it did. The lap zone there, right, uh, especially along the coastline where there was a, quite a bit of ice accretion a week and a half ago, and now we've got snow on top of it. But as you get farther away from the coastline, they didn't deal with that ice, and we're just talking about a really heavy consistency of snow. Unfortunately, that's all it really comes down to. Um, you know, I think CMP used the term tree loading. Sure, I mean, it's sticking to all these branches. And to give you some perspective on how bad it is on some of these side streets here in Wyndham and driving through Gray to get here, there were more dramatic scenes that Jacob and uh, my photographer and I saw on the way here, but I, I we kind of felt like it wasn't safe to stop. All the trees were leaning on top of the road and they looked like they were gonna crack at any moment. So it just didn't make sense to stop there. So that's what those side streets look like off the main route, which is not quite as bad. Talk about the divergence uh, based on where you are exactly. As you head towards the coast, this is more of a wind thing. Here, I would describe it as breezy, but I don't think that is playing very much into the um, trees that you see down here. I think we're talking again, just exclusively about the weight of that snow. Brian and Amanda, anecdotally, to give you an idea again of how quickly things change in a short distance, I woke up this morning in my house, I texted you guys, I looked out the window and I could still see some grass and I thought, oh no, you know, this forecast has gone horribly wrong. Drive a half mile, got a couple inches, another half mile, five inches. It's, it's really a remarkable storm system and how it changes from the immediate coastline to just a few miles inland. And I think that will continue uh, through this afternoon, this evening, as the storm keeps going here uh, over the next few hours. All right, Keith Carson live for us in Wyndham. Thank you, Keith. Let's